So now let's see how we can utilize the guided tilt shift option inside of Adobe Photoshop Elements. So to do that, you need to go around over here onto the guided tab right here. And once you go around onto the guided tab, you can see that tilt shift is an option right here. So if I were to go around over here onto tilt shift, then this is what you have as you can see. You can go around and click on add tilt shift right here. And there you go. Tilt shift has been added right here just like this. You can go around on to modify focus area right here and just click and drag and you can see that that becomes the new tilt shift. So you can go around and select out of focus area just by dragging and that becomes the new um, focus area as you can see right here just like this. You can go around and refine out the effect right here by changing out the blur level as you can see. You can decrease out the blur level over here and you can well, increase around the con contrast of the blur and saturation of the blur or decrease out the saturation of the blur area over here as well. So let me just go around and then increase out the saturation a bit and modify out the focus area right here to focus around right on this section right here just like this. So let me just go around and then click and drag around right here and then you can uh, focus out let's say for example on the bottom part right here while everything else blurs out. Let me go to refine as right here and decrease the blur amount over here just like this or increase up the blur amount according to how you like it and work around with the contrast over here just like this as well. So that is how you can work around with the guided tilt shift option inside of Adobe Photoshop Elements. So I hope you guys learned something as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe.